We don't know what causes rheumatoid arthritis exactly. We know that it's an abnormality of the immune system that causes inflammation in the joints. And we think that this uh, is, is uh, a combination of uh, genetic risk factors um, as well as um, uh, some chance and also uh, something in the environment, although probably the environmental trigger is different for different people and there's no one particular trigger that seems to cause rheumatoid arthritis in everyone. The cause of rheumatoid arthritis is unknown, but about 30% of the risk is genetic, 70% of the risk is environmental, and the most important environmental factor that we can modify is, in fact, cigarette smoking. So smokers not only are at an increased risk of developing rheumatoid arthritis, but they can get more severe disease and they respond less well to treatment. A very important risk factor that's totally avoidable, of course, is smoking. So if we could stop people from smoking, we could prevent a lot of rheumatoid arthritis that way. But there isn't a simple, single cause that we can put our finger on. Well, rheumatoid arthritis can be, you know, quite a difficult disease to explain. But the bottom line is it's related to the immune system, which malfunctions in a way that means that your own cells are attacking your joint tissues. And over a period of time, if that's not controlled, it erodes through the cartilage, which sits at the end of each bone in a joint, and can actually erode through into the bone and cause damage and deformity. And that's the thing that is critical to avoid.